SSR is particularly dedicated to doing research relevant to social services. Our research projects, training and publications speak to the needs of people who require social services and are committed to improving these services. This funding from MSF and TOAD Board is indeed timely. SSR's record for collaborative research and training has been long enough now for it to be the go-to centre for improving research capability in the sector. The funding meets two needs in particular. First, it equips social service professionals with the ability to do research. We are seeing that more social service agencies are incorporating research into their practice, but they often lack research capability. So with this funding support, SSR can expand our training and equipping services. Second, the funding will enable wider sharing of research knowledge and findings. You see, social services should benefit from academic research findings, and as agencies do more research on their own, their findings should be shared more widely for the benefit of the whole sector. So in SSR, we really want to help aggregate and propagate knowledge, and this funding support will enable us to do that. MSF has been funding and working with SSR to advance research for the sector since it started. We are very happy to continue this partnership with a sharpened focus on strengthening practice research among social service agencies. Topart hopes that this capability development fund for SSR will help build a stronger culture of accountability within the sector through two things. One, to boost the sector impact measurement capabilities and two, to drive more robust database solutions that will help the social service agencies improve the services that they deliver. I think SSR is well placed to take on this role with its strong links and good track record with many agencies. Topo and MSF both look forward to working with SSR to expand and level up the practice research capabilities. The funds from MSF and Tote Board will support SSR in four areas. Namely, workshops for practitioners who want to equip themselves with research and evaluation skills, SSR's Research Capability Development Service for practitioners who require guidance while working on their projects, monthly seminars and annual conferences, and publications which cover current issues in the sector. I highly encourage practitioners to visit our website and join our mailing list so that they can benefit regularly from what SSR has to offer.